All right, hello everyone. My name is Exceeding Show slash Sharon's Forex, and today we're going to GameStop. Why? Because today is the launch of Pokemon X and Y. And I'm actually walking there because I don't have a car. Well, I have a car, but I, I don't. I can't drive. So, plus I would have actually waste my money to drive to GameStop and come back because I'm just that cheap. <laughs> Anyways, it's really windy and it's really gonna get noisy because of the cars, but all that stuff. But whatever. And a bus just seriously just passed right by me, and it's just about there. So, yeah. But seriously, I just see you guys at GameStop, or I will just meet you back when I'm at home. Yeah, that's best. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go get the Pokemon X and then go home and play it all day. All right, see you guys in a sec. Or maybe I gain something. I don't know. Depends. See you guys in a second. Yep. Look at that little beauty. Oh, this is what I got today. Yeah. Anyways. Anyways, yeah, oh my gosh, this, it looks so beautiful, doesn't it? It just looks so beautiful. And I'm playing it, yeah. Uh, so anyways, my name's Exceeding Shadow. Uh, yeah, okay, so it's from earlier today. Earlier today, and I mean way earlier today, it was like 9 o'clock-ish. Ish. When I went to go get a game, stop and go buy X version only. And, uh, apparently I found out that the guidebook, for some weird reason, it's not going to be in stores until next week, which sounds really weird, but not that makes no sense. I don't know, but anyway, it's just it's it's weird. Anyways, uh, today I want to say that I played a good chunk of Pokemon X, not Y, but just X only. But I gotta say, I'm liking the game. But it, to me, it just feels like they're recycling a lot of Pokemon I already caught and, you know, seen past generations, as in all of them. <laughs> so, 1 through 5. I thought the whole game maybe will have maybe a teeny couple Pokemon that's from the past gen, but this one's like blowing it all away, kind of like, okay, you're getting a Snorlax, a Absol, a Zigzagoon, a Zangoose, a Pikachu, a Pidgey. For peak's sake, so you're giving me like every freaking thing that I already got from past generation of Pokemon. Which, that's not a bad thing, it's just that it kind of shows me that there's not that many new Pokemon at all. I mean, it took me a couple tries to find Pokemon I actually wanted to find, just because I want to see how they were or how they battled and stuff. It took me a little tr while to find some Pokemon, like, I, for some reason I cannot find a lit, a lit, a lit Leo or whatever, for the male version of it, I've been just finding the freaking female, which I don't want the female. You're probably saying that's sexist. No, there's actually a difference between the two, uh, appearance-wise. But, uh, yeah, the, the male one looks more like, like you know, like an a actual lion. The other one doesn't really look like, you know, like a cheetah or something. I don't know. But still, I'm, I'm liking the game a lot. It's just that it's a lot of time into it. I mean... Yeah, I got lost here and there because, well, it's it's blind. It's blind, you know. I'm not knowing what the hell to do. I'm knowing only from, like, from the first ship and that was it. That's it. And then from there on, I just, I don't know what to do. And then I just, you know, catch some Pokemon. I've been training. I don't even know if I need to. And then I'm, like, kind of thinking in my head, why well, am I supposed to get to, like, the second gym by now? Because I'm, like, level 20 on, like, almost all my Pokemon. Seriously, like, almost all my Pokemon. And I'm already level... 20. Yeah, so. I know you're supposed to be like a, almost level 20 when you reach the second gym on like almost every game. But this time, I'm already over 20. I'm like tw like 22, 3 ish on some of Pokemon. Other ones are still about on just 20. But it's still like, wow, they put a lot of time into this game because you could actually tell the animation. The graphics, the the gameplay wise, and even things you didn't even realize was being the game, which made it even ten times better. It's in the game. They went all out with this one. I mean, if you want to play Pokemon and you only want to play it for the originals, 
don't be afraid. They're actually in the game. They're actually in it. If you don't want to play with the newer Pokemon because they look stupid or something to you, don't worry. If you want to play with the originals, they're in there. Except, yeah, even the starters are in there, for Pete's sake. If you want Charmander, get it. Squirtle, get it. Bulbasaur, get it. But be warned, you can't get it in the very, very beginning of the game. You have to get it after the second... Uh, sorry, the, after the first gym is already done and then you, you do other things. But you still have chances to get Pokemon that you already got from past generations or from your childhood, as in Pidgey and Pikachu and Caterpie, Weedle, and just a couple others to name. But just there's a lot of Pokemon that just kind of recycle from the past. And yeah, there might be some weird Pokemon that's in this generation. But what can I say? I'm not, I'm not really getting them. But, like, there's this one weird one. It's called, like, Hawk Gucha or something like that. To me, it looks like a fused together of a hawk and a luchador kind of thing. That's, that's what it looks like to me, seriously. I think that's even what it's actually supposed to be. But there's just some weird-looking ones. And actually, some really cool-looking ones. Like Tyrant, 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 uh, Pancham. Uh, <laughs> I can't think of all the names because I'm still trying to get used to a lot of these names. Haunted is okay to me. It's just a sword, but... I don't know. Just... I don't know. But just look at the cotton candy Pokemon. Cause that makes more sense. But I don't know. There's a lot of Pokemon in this game that just kind of make me think, like... It feels like they're really running out of ideas now. Like, the past gen, I a lot of the references actually made sense to me right now, but... This gen, it's like... You're seriously just mixing things together into a Pokemon now? Like, I understand a lot of people said, oh, you're running out of ideas since the 4th gen or 3rd gen. They didn't run out of ideas on that part. Seriously, they didn't run out of all of the ideas. 5th gen, I understood a little bit on probably the t Vanillix and uh, the Trash Pokemon. I forgot his name. Uh, but there's just some that just stick out and actually remember and are really cool looking. But this gen, I feel like they just ran out of ideas. They made mega evolutions from past Pokemon that we already loved and know. And they just made them cooler or dumber, depending on your, you know, favorites or how they look or what's not. And plus, they didn't even really add that many new generation Pokemon, like brand new species. We didn't get that many. But all the ones they did give us, they're... They're okay, but not all of them. Like, almost half, or even half, I just don't really approve of or really think they're cool looking. But the other half, I totally understand. You know, we finally got a panda Pokemon. We got an actual looking Tyrannosaurus Rex Pokemon. We got a Loch Ness looking kind of monster, even though we already got Lapras from the beginning. But another looking kind of Lapras kind of thing. Uh, we got... A Firefox, even though it's already been done before, with Vulpix. Uh, we got, you know, just a lot of things. Past generation, we finally got a Penguin, which was... No, 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 that was fourth generation. We got a Penguin. An Otter, which was uh, Oshawa. And also got a Penguin, and you know, all that other stuff. But now it just feels like they're seriously running out of ideas. Like, it really does. And I, if I... Like... Just some Pokemon, just kind of like, why did they make this? Like, Flabibi? I get it's a plant, or not plant, a grass type Pokemon, but it's just a flower, and I know there's some Pokemon that is flowers, but they can pass it off, but I don't know on that one. But they're just some Pokemon that just seriously feels like they're not true Pokemon. I mean, I would classify some. I would classify for some Digimon for Pete's sake to be Pokemon, actually. But I know they're not. But um, that's really my opinions for now. I'm only up to the second gym. But that's all about for now. But I guess I guess just see you guys tomorrow because I have nothing much to say other than I'm gonna keep playing Pokemon X for the rest of the night. And that's about it. That's really it. I'm not going to play no Halo 4. I'm not going to play anything else. I'm not going to watch anything. I haven't even watched anything other than YouTube videos. But that does not count. Anyways, my name is Phoenix. Channel. Like the video, subscribe, leave it comes below. And I'll see you guys for the next episode of Let's Vlog tomorrow. Thought I need to come up with a better outro. How about we just do this for one little time. And I have to think seriously about an outro for this vlog. <laughs> Alright. 
Let's all meet tomorrow back here, shall we? Steven plays. Or vlogs or George. Steven. <laughs> Alright, I'll think of a I'll seriously think of a an outro. But seriously, I'll just see you guys tomorrow, okay? Alright, uh so deuces.